Good morning everyone and welcome to another YouTube video. I'm going to vlog today and kind of take you with me on my day by making friends. Right now I'm outside getting some sunlight and grounding in and drinking this milky honey peppermint tea and, and also listening to the birds as you can hear. I really like having tea first thing in the morning with like honey and milk because it's really hydrating and just like a nice warm cozy way to start the day. And I'm about to go and make some breakfast so I'll show you what I'm having. Alright, this is what I have going on for breakfast. I have some goose and duck eggs, which I think I'm actually going to have duck eggs today, not goose. These are so big. These are the goose eggs and then the smaller ones are the duck eggs. And I'm probably going to have some fruit and some milk, so I'll show you what that looks like. I actually decided I'm going to do goose eggs, and then I was like, wait, let me show you how big these eggs are. So, they're much harder to crack. Like, the shell is very hard. And that's how big the egg is. Like, look at that. I have huge hands. Like, I can easily palm a basketball. And this is how big the egg is. Just two eggs, I feel like, is six or seven chicken eggs. This is literally just two eggs. That is so much egg. <laughs> okay, this is what I'm having for breakfast. I have my two goose eggs, an orange, some fresh picked blueberries, and a glass of raw milk. Blueberries are definitely one of my favorite fruits. Any berry, I really like strawberries, blueberries, raspberries. I'm making some coffee in the French press now, and this is the coffee that I use. It's from Kion. I ran out for a couple days and just finally got my package in yesterday, so I definitely recommend getting organic coffee because if coffee is not organic, it is so heavily pesticided, sprayed, and it also tends to have mold, so it's really important to get one that is certified free of all of those things. All right, now I'm having some coffee with raw milk and I'm going to enjoy this and then head out. I need to go get my oil changed for my car. I am outside waiting to get my oil changed now and making some phone calls under this really beautiful oak tree I'll show you. Florida has all of these really old ancient oak trees and the Spanish moss is so pretty. I am driving to my favorite little health food market right now to pick up a few things and I'm kind of thirsty so I'm gonna grab a drink while I'm there. This is another reason that I make my own toothpaste because even this health brand that's Ayurvedic, if you look at the ingredients, it has glycerin which is basically a seed oil so and when you brush your teeth, you're obviously ingesting some of the toothpaste. So just another reason to make your own toothpaste. This is why I was really excited to come to the store today because I found this new coconut water in glass. So we're going to try it. All right, I got my groceries and I'm going to go try that coconut water. This brand is called Alaya. It's organic, pure king coconut water. So I just spilled it all over myself. Taste test. That's really good, actually. And I really like that it's in glass, too. This is everything that I got at the store. I just picked up a few things. So I got some kiwi, some sardines, carrots, and then I also got this yogurt, which is an organic, grass-fed Greek yogurt that I really like. If I'm not having raw yogurt, I will go for this. Okay, this is what I have for lunch. I have some sardines with gruyere and honey, and oh my gosh, I love dipping gruyere in honey. It is so good. And then I also have some blueberries and some Greek yogurt with maple syrup and bee pollen. I'm going to enjoy my lunch now and then do some work on my computer before I head out to the gym later. I am going to take a little nap. I got a little sleepy, so... I think I'm going to take a nap and then go for a walk outside. I'm not really feeling the gym today. I'm like towards the end of my cycle, so my energy is a little bit down and I'm going to listen to my body, so not going to lift today. 
but I am going to go for a nice walk outside and get some sunshine. This is my little loft that I sleep in and all of my bedding is made of natural materials. It's really important that what you sleep on is made of natural materials because think of how much time you're spending in your bed. You're spending at least eight hours, well you should be spending eight hours in your bed every night. And all of that time, your skin is on your bedding, your comforter, your sheets, your head is on your pillow. So I have organic cotton sheets and blankets. And then I also sleep on this pillow from the Woolshire. This is literally the most comfortable pillow I've ever slept on in my life. And it's made of wool and all natural materials. So I just feel really good laying my head on this and knowing that I am sleeping in a way that really supports my health. Okay, I'll see you guys on the other side of my nap. I just had a spoonful of honey. Since it had been a few hours since I ate, I also had a couple bites of cheese, and then I'm bringing this orange on the walk with me to have during. I'm heading out to go figure out the walking situation. I was told about this bridge, but we'll see what happens. I just pulled up to the beach, and I'm hungry. <laughs> I'm going to go for a walk, get some sunshine, I was going to go to that bridge I told you guys about, but I just thought about it and I would rather go for my walk and be barefoot and get some grounding in. Walking by the ocean, feet in the ocean, is one of the best ways that you can ground because water is super conductive to electrical energy, so a great way to ground is by going for ocean walks. Oh my god, this little clementine is so good. Hmm. I'm also going to chew some Greco gum while I go for a walk. This gum is literally made just from the sap of a tree. And I definitely recommend switching to this gum from other gums. Because literally every other gum is full of chemicals and all of this stuff that's really harmful for your gut. Greco gum is actually good for your gut. It's anti-inflammatory and antibacterial. Yeah, it's literally just made from the sap of a tree. I have an affiliate link, I'll put it in the description. If you've never tried Greco before, I have a code Ashley and you can try it and get free shipping. I am home now from the beach and something that I like to do when I go on my walks is Make it a gratitude walk, so I really like to feel into everything that I'm grateful for, so my healthy body that is able to run and dance and move, and I am so grateful for my cozy home and the bed that I get to sleep in. I am so grateful for the sun, and I am so grateful for the trees that are providing oxygen for us to breathe and go into my lungs and nourish my body and the food that I get to eat. So incredibly grateful for all of these things. So I like to think about that when I'm on my walk and gratitude is a very powerful frequency and energy. This world is like a sea of energy and if you think of yourself, you are a powerful being. You have the power to emit your own frequency. Your heart has an electromagnetic field so you are able to create a frequency and emit this out into the world. And this is affecting everything. Like you are not separate from anything. And this is affecting the entire sea of energy out there. And if you want to experience things that you desire, having gratitude will help draw this experience into your reality. Everything is connected and everything is energy and frequency. So your emotions are very powerful and they can draw experiences into your life, literally. Your mind and your thoughts and your energy is creating your entire reality. And the universe understands frequency and energy. So if you want to show the universe and the world what you like and what you want to see more of, show gratitude for the things in your life that you love and that you want to experience more of because the universe will receive this message about how grateful you are for this thing and want to give you more of it and it will be drawn into your life so gratitude is a really powerful practice okay this is what i'm having for dinner i have some raw grass-fed organic ground beef with raw butter on top and then i also have dates with butter 
and some honey to dip the beef in, as well as a glass of raw milk. I'm also eating a carrot because raw carrot a day, and yeah, I'm going to enjoy my dinner now. I am getting into bed now. I have an early day tomorrow. I wake up around 4 a.m. for a farmer's market, so I'm in bed early. I'm going to read, and I'm also having a tea and a bedtime snack. So I'll show you what I'm having. This is my bedtime snack. I'm having some blueberries and coconut butter along with my milky tea. I always like to end the night with having a tea. It's just so comforting and a nice way to end the day reading a book with a cup of tea. I'm also wearing my blue light blocking glasses. These are from Raw Optics and these are the ones that I wear. If you want to improve your sleep, improve your metabolism, and improve so many aspects of your health, I highly recommend investing in a pair of blue light glasses. Your light environment is so important for your health because the light that is going into your eyes is signaling to your body what time of day it is and it's so much important information. I'll put a link down below if you want to check them out. These are the ones that I recommend if you want to improve your health. Blue light blocking is essential and you want to be in natural lighting as much as possible and stay out of blue light as much as possible, especially after sunset. I will immediately put these glasses on if I'm using my phone. I hope that you guys enjoyed today's video. I'll see you in the next video.